today we'll see how to turn this into this This is a rain meter skin so we need rain meter. Copy the link in the description below and paste it in the any standard web browser. So this is what you want to download. Click on download. Once the file is downloaded, go to the downloaded folder and click on install. Click on next, select the location and click on install. Once it is installed, you will be shown the default skins, which we don't want by the way. So right click on them and unload the skins. Let me quickly do that. Now let's download the wallpaper. Copy the link in the description below and paste it in the browser. And downloading the wallpaper of size 1920 by 1080p. Once it is downloaded, Open it in the downloaded folder. Click on set as desktop background. It's looking nice. Now let's clean up the desktop. Right click anywhere on the desktop and uncheck the show desktop icons. It's looking pretty neat already. Now let's change few more settings and get that aesthetic look. Now go to the taskbar and right click and click on properties. Now here you need to select auto hide the taskbar. This will hide the taskbar whenever you're not using it. And it's looking pretty neat, right? Now let's download the clock and visualizer and get the complete look. Copy the link and paste it in the browser. And this is how it looks. Okay, scroll down a bit, download the clock. Once it is downloaded, go to the downloaded folder, right click on the file and click on install rain meter skin. Now click on install. This will install the clock skin. As you can see, this is how it looks. Currently I'm placing it on the top of the astronaut. Feel free to move it around and see the best location for it. Now let's download the visualizer. Copy the link and paste it in the browser. And this is how it looks. By the way, you can change the bar colors as well. Okay, let me download it. Once it is downloaded, this is a tricky part. It is not like a direct install. You need to right click on the file and click on extract to the folder. Once it is extracted, open the folder and we need to copy this folder into the Rainmeter skins. Okay, now you need to go to documents and you will find a folder called Rainmeter. Open that and there will be a folder called skins and you need to paste that copied folder here. Now let's see whether we got the skin in the rain meter. On the bottom right corner, we can see the rain meter, click on it. So initially it won't show up. You need to click on refresh all. Now you can see the Lano visual master. So this is a visualizer. Click on visualizer.ini to load it. I'm placing it at the bottom. Now let's see some settings of it. Click on general.ini and click on load. So this will load the general settings. Now head over to visualization. So these are the default settings. Set the bar width, bar gap and bar count as shown in the notepad to get the best look out of it. Currently, I'm going with the default settings. Let me play a song and see how this theme came out. So 
so that's it guys i hope it came out very well let me know what you think about it in the comment section below i also made few other themes as well if you are interested in them please check out the playlist make your pc look cool if you like the video please like share comment and subscribe to my channel thank you for watching see you in another video